Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover the divisibility rule for 11. Now remember, when we're checking for divisibility, we're checking to see if we can divide without getting a remainder. So the given numbers work out exactly. Now let's go through four examples here and see if they are divisible by 11 based on the rule at the top of the screen. So we're going to add the odd digits, add the even digits, and then find the difference. If that difference is divisible by 11, then the original number is divisible by 11. When I mention odd and even digits, that doesn't mean odd and even numbers. You'll see what I mean um, as we go through our examples. So let's jump into number one where we have 693. And the first thing I wanna do is count from left to right our digits. So six is one, our first digit. Nine is two and three is three. So that's what I mean by odd and even digits. Six and three are the odd digits and nine is the even digits. So let's add our odd digits, six and three. I'll put odd equals six plus three is nine and even well we just have one digit and it's a nine so let's find the difference so nine minus nine equals zero so this is our difference and we need to see if that is divisible by 11. zero is divisible by any number therefore it's divisible by 11. since our result is divisible by 11 that means our original number 693 is divisible by 11 as well. Let's try this again with number two. So we have 72,457. So let's count our digits. One, two, three, four, and five. So odd and even. So the odd digits, seven plus four is 11. So seven plus four is 11 plus seven is 18. The even digits, well, we have two plus five is seven. So let's find the difference here. We have 18 minus seven, which gives us 11. 11 is divisible by 11. Therefore, our original number, 72,457, is divisible by 11. On to number three, where we have 91,580. So let's count off one, two, three, four, five. So odd and even. So odd, we have nine plus five is 14 plus zero. So we end up with 14 here. Now even, we have one plus eight, which is nine. So 14 minus nine gives us five. Five is not divisible by 11, therefore 91,580 is not divisible by 11 either. And lastly, number four, we have 8,153,783. So let's count off our digits. Always start from the left, remember? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven digits odd, even. So the odd, we have eight plus five is 13, plus seven is 20, plus three is 23. And the even, so we have one plus three is four, plus eight is going to give us 12. So we end up with 23 minus 12, which equals 11. So 11 is divisible by 11, Therefore, our original number of 8,153,783 is divisible by 11 as well. So there you have it. There's the divisibility rule for 11. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.